Hey everyone! This video is going to be a quiz style video for the bony landmarks of the scapula. So follow along, write down your answers, and then I'll go over them in the second half of this video. My first question to you is, is this a right or a left scapula? Look at the landmarks that are important and visualize it um, on your body and try to determine if it's a right or a left. All right, so now question one is this landmark. Two. Three. Four, five, six, and seven, eight, and nine. I'll give you a better view of nine. Got ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And 15. For a bonus question, write down what bone and feature articulates with landmark number 15. All right, pause the video, go back if you need, and um, now I'll review the answers. All right, I just wanna make sure this isn't glaring weird. All right, so this is a right scapula. Number one is the infraspinous fossa. Two, this is your inferior angle. Three is the spinoglenoid notch. Four is the acromion process. Five is the spine of the scapula. Remember to be specific that it's of the scapula. Six this is going to be your medial border. And then seven is your lateral border. Eight, this is your supraspinous fossa. Nine, it's going to be your supraglenoid tubercle. Ten is your coracoid process. Eleven is your superior angle. Twelve is the suprascapular notch. 13 is your infraglenoid tubercle. Oh, let me fix that real quick. Come on. There we go. Infraglenoid tubercle. Where is it? Here. Fourteen is your subscapular fossa. This whole thing. 15 is your glenoid fossa, or your glenoid cavity. And the head of the humerus articulates with the glenoid fossa. All right, hope that was helpful.